hello welcome to my channel actively planning where we do all things planning my weekly spread in my passion planner just an fyi this spread is actually a small size and it has a monday start so i kind of like having my saturday and sundays together kind of like the weekends together and then the week together it's just more fluid in my eyes and i can add more onto that weekend section so anyways for this week i'm kind of going with these blue hues um with one of my sticker books here i'm also going to be in that theme of the blue incorporating these two actually one of them is navy blue and one of them is black kind of going with that vibe i have my icon stickers which i definitely need to get some more of these youtube ones which i will write down very soon and then of course i have my make id label printer which i pre-printed some of my labels here actually i'm missing one um, here it is okay so I pre-printed those so that I have them and of course I still have not gotten any white out so we're just gonna go straight into the washi and the reason I say that if you watch my previous video is because I literally ran out of white out as I was filming so it's just something that I love to do being able to white out some of these sections so that the washi tape is super crisp I mean this spread does have this dark color so it actually is okay but sometimes you can definitely see in like underneath the washi tape and it kind of at least for me is not as pleasing to the eye but that is just something that you know as a creative it kind of bugs me <laughs> but it is something that is always up to the person so anyways, I'm going to go ahead, add some washi tape onto certain sections, and then we're going to get to planning. into the planning part I'm actually gonna keep with this blue kind of hue tone so I'm gonna stick with all of my blue markers here but this week there is something super exciting happening on Thursday which means I finally should be talking about it or announcing it uh, we've kind of kept it kind of on the down low a little bit um, in terms of social media and stuff like that and it's the fact that we are moving into our first home on well we close on thursday and officially move on saturday and i am just so freaking excited <laughs> and it's something that you know we've been waiting for a while and something that you know we've been wanting for a while and it's finally happening we've been you know in this waiting game for a while but it's just so so exciting for that and there is something to say about you know growing up and being in that you know environment of growth because this is something that you know is a huge step and it's a huge step of personal growth and you know your relationships and your environment everything is changing and it is something to say about being able to adapt with that growth because obviously we're changing you know where exactly we're living how we're living you know different circumstances events and all this stuff environment and it's something about you know you being able to be okay with change that makes it easy because i know so many people get so stuck in this limbo of everything needs to stay the same because that is the way it should be but in reality when you don't let change happen when you're not you know accepting of change many times it could be the thing that breaks you and we don't want that right we want something that you know helps us grow that helps us develop ourselves that helps us you know improve with everything that is going on and if we stay in this life of i don't want things to change because i'm too comfortable then how are we supposed to grow in any way shape or form we want to be able to be challenged we want to be able to feel you know 
excitement with the change and the kind of the unknown obviously the unknown is scary but sometimes that unknown is something that you should be excited about something that you should look forward to and many things like a change like this where we are literally moving this week it is something that obviously it's super scary because it's literally our fir first home but it's something that is so exciting that it's hard to even say we don't want this for example we don't want this change that's not the point of you know growth and being able to be open to that kind of growth and happenings and all that stuff and I just love being able to see actually when people are going through growth it shows a lot who is open for opportunities who is open for change and who is open to be let's say challenged in some way shape or form it's awesome to be able to grow it's awesome to see people grow as well and something like this definitely is going to be a mini challenge you know adapting to all the new things and patience when unpacking and packing and all those things but I am just so excited because it is a huge opportunity for growth for both of us and my dog let's be real but it's something that everyone should embrace and be grateful that you actually have opportunities like that for growth so anyways that is a little ta over tangent there, but I'm just gonna go ahead, add in all of my time blocking here. The week is still going to be the same as much as possible because life is still going, even with the big changes, but this is something that um, we are just so, so excited about. But anyways, let me go ahead, finish this up really, really quick. So this bottom right section is usually where I add the quote of the week and this week's quote is focus on improving not proving yourself and it kind of goes hand in hand with what I was talking about with the whole growth and stuff we always want to be improving and that happens with growth it happens with challenges it happens with getting outside of our comfort zone it does not and never will happen when you're trying to like prove yourself to other people. Maybe in some way you can kind of prove it to yourself in terms of believing that you can, not breaking promises to yourself, but in reality when we want to be able to, you know, grow and be our true authentic self, it's about improvement 
not necessarily proving yourself to someone. So I love, love, love this quote and that is the reason why I'm adding it this week because growth happens whether you like it or not. It just depends on if you allow it to truly happen or if you're just trying to prove yourself to someone else. So let me go ahead and finish up this quote. Let's head into the bottom left section. This is where I add all of my trackers, especially for my wellness business. Again, I've talked about this many, many times, but when it comes to trackers, it is literally the way to be able to see and track your progress. Because you being able to see, let's say I'm gonna um, give an example of like working out or drinking water, when you track, okay, I did three workouts a week instead of doing, let's say five, that is better than my previous week where I just did two. That's improvement. That is something that should be celebrated. And you being able to track things like that is how you're seeing your progress towards whatever it is of a goal that you have. And again, it doesn't have to necessarily go with your wellness journey. It could literally go for anything. I know people that have used trackers for tracking how many pages a day they're writing for their book or how many pages of personal development they're reading a week. Um, I've seen people obviously track their water, track if they have less screen time. All of those different things are great ways of measurement of progress that you are able to use every single week. And obviously you can always change them. So let me go ahead and finish this up really quick because it is something that will forever be in every single one of my spreads. Let's go into four of my favorite, favorite sections. So this one here is actually going to be for my gratitude. I love that this sticker book has like the perfect size of this one for the gratitude. So I love being able to use it because it is literally perfect for it. Plus, I'm actually gonna show you, let me just put the sticker on really quick for the title. I actually wanna show you these little weekly trackers are perfect for tracking goals. This sticker book honestly has like, it is exactly what I need for every single week because of these tiny little details of a weekly tracker, big boxes, labels here, and then even for my to-do boxes, they are just absolutely perfect for all of it. So I, that was a little tangent there, but I just love being able to track my goals here especially something like this where I can literally just cross them off. So I'm also gonna be adding my to-do boxes, which also perfect size boxes. Obviously I'm going to be blocking off a little bit there, but I know what happens in my PM routine, so that's okay. But I love being able to add in my to-dos as well. And I love being able to space them because knowing me and how I procrastinate and how I delegate to other days, it's just easier for me to add things for me to do from Monday through Wednesday. Those are my to-dos. And then from Thursday through Sunday, this is going to be my to-dos, this other box. So it's just an easier way to stay less um, overwhelmed and actually get things done because I know how my workflow is and this is the way that I'm able to do. Plus, whenever I see a giant to-do list, I get so overwhelmed that I just can't do it. Like, I just can't function. So it's just a great way for me to be able to like space things out and actually get things done. So anyways, I'm gonna go ahead, have some fun with some stickers because obviously, and yeah, just, have some fun, see what comes up as I go through it.
this spread. Absolutely love that it's like in the blue hues. It's kind of calming. And obviously, once I finish filming here, I'll add in all of the stuff. I do that mostly obviously for privacy reasons, but then also if not, this video would take forever so you could watch it with decent time and without the overwhelm. So anyways, hopefully this was motivating and hopefully you like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you here for another video very soon. Okay, bye.